Next weekend, hundreds of thousands of holiday wreaths will be laid on the graves of veterans across the country. An idea that started with a wreath maker in Maine to place Christmas wreaths on every grave at Arlington National Cemetery has now spread across the nation. At thousands of cemeteries, large and small, volunteers will place wreaths on the graves of veterans, which in the Northeast in the middle of December can be a challenge. At the old Post Cemetery on the former Air Force Base in Plattsburgh, they had to bring in snowblowers a few years ago to clear paths to get to the headstone. And this week, Pete Siskovich was marking the graves of 161 veterans at the St. Bernard's and United Methodist Cemetery in the hamlet of Lion Mountain, grave sites that are buried under more than a foot of fresh snow. This is the first time that volunteers here are joining in wreaths across America and placing holiday wreaths on the headstone of every veteran buried here. I have grandfathers, uncles, laid the rest here, veterans. I believe there are roughly around 400 actual graves in the cemetery, and 161 is quite substantial for this little town. So I'm hoping we have a good turnout. The ceremony and wreath laying will take place next Saturday, December 15th at 12 noon at this cemetery in Lion Mountain, as well as St. Michael's Cemetery in the neighboring town of Standish. Donations have poured in to cover the cost of the wreaths, and Siskovich is hoping that people will attend and join in both the wreath laying and ceremony, where the name of each and every veteran will be read aloud. He also hopes this may become a yearly tradition in Lion Mountain, honoring and remembering the community's veterans during the holidays. Remember our fallen veterans, honor those who serve, and teach our young the value of freedom.